CBS 8's Kelly Hesedal joins us live from downtown San Diego with the big development. Kelly. That's right. You know, we're just a few days out of the primary and things are already getting ugly. Now, according to the plaintiff's attorney, she dropped this lawsuit because both she and her family were being threatened as well as harassed. Larry Turner, however, told me that uh, he was supposed to be deposed on Monday and he says he was looking forward to it. Here we are now. It's going to be me and the mayor. Uh, in November. So, um, you know, he's got to stand on his record. He's going to keep trying to do these things. I mean, this is the playbook that these guys do. You know, it's going to be another fictional story next week and the next week. That's a smoke screen. If you want to do the smoke screen, that's fine. But produce the facts first, and then you'd have an argument that maybe this was done politically. But they've never produced the evidence. And so this lawsuit challenging Turner's residency appears to be over, at least for now. Now, Turner's camp still maintains Mayor Gloria's people are behind all of this, and they say that's the real issue with this case. Bob Adderley, the plaintiff's attorney, says the mayor has nothing to do with this, and he maintains everything in the 34-page brief he submitted to the court is true. He points out that Turner called a news conference today. Uh, why didn't he show reporters evidence uh, proving San Diego was his primary home last year when he filed papers to run for mayor? Uh, he says because if it turns out that Turner is not eligible to run, this could be a mess for the city down the road. And I feel sorry for Mr. Turner. I really do, because I think it appears he made a mistake and he hasn't produced the proof that would get him out of it. If he was not qualified during those 30 days at issue, then he can never fix that. And I followed every rule and I'll continue to do that. I have no strings attached and I don't owe anybody any favors. So what you're going to see when I'm mayor is you're going to see stuff really getting done in the city and not tens of millions of dollars going to these friends of the mayor. And the mayor's office uh, maintains uh, he's not paying attention to any of this. Uh, he has nothing to do with this. They say that he is just focused on doing his job as the mayor right now. He says he does not care who he runs against in November. Marcelo and Carlo. So, Kelly, do we know what kind of proof Turner planned to bring to that deposition that would have taken place Monday had the lawsuit not been dropped? And what are election officials saying about all of this? That's right. And I reached out to uh, Turner's attorneys and they told me that he planned to bring records and checks and documents. Uh, they say that he does have proof that he was a San Diego resident last year when he filed papers to run for mayor. Uh, as for election officials, uh, I reached out to the registrar of voters. I reached out to the city clerk's office. I got the runaround quite a bit. Uh, finally, the registrar of voters uh, referred me to the city clerk's office and they said they had no comment.